welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a cook and clean. I'm going to start off and I'm going to be boiling some eggs because I have those for the week when I'm working and then I'm going to make a crock pot dish and then we're going to clean up the kitchen and do some laundry. Stick around if you like to see some of this. So now I'm rinsing my eggs, or I should say I am emptying out the hot water. I'm going to shock them with ice cold water and I'm going to let them sit and cool. Meantime, I'm going to start my crock pot dish and this is my calico beans. It's one of my family's favorites, especially around Easter time. It's got hamburger and beans, all different types of beans, onions and ketchup and dried mustard, brown sugar and white wine vinegar. It is really nummy and I'll go through it step by step when I start doing my crock pot dish. So we're going to add hamburger. Make sure all the fat is drained out. You want to add four cans of beans. It's supposed to be lima, kidney, baked, and butter. I don't like kidney so I substitute for extra can of baked. So you just add those in. Then you're going to add one cup of brown sugar, one fourth cup of ketchup, excuse me, one teaspoon of dry mustard, three tablespoons of white wine vinegar, and oh, I almost forgot the onion that I cut up. You can also add bacon. I didn't add any bacon, and you can add celery. I did not add celery as well. I will leave the recipe in the description box below so you guys can see it. And I did have to put two cans of lima beans in there because they were small and you want 16 ounces and they were both eight so I did have to put two cans of those in.
Okay. And so now I'm gonna drain the eggs and I do dry them off so I don't get so much moisture in this container. And then I'm gonna put them in the fridge and I'm all ready for the work week. And I just take two a day. dread this part but it is satisfying because when you're done cooking and your kitchen is clean it feels so much better right right spray that it's not spraying good so I had to apply some CLR to the head of this so it could take away those hard water deposits and it worked wonderful and I also baked smoked turkey drumsticks oh my gosh look at how they fell off the bone I did have a little taste they were wonderful I love them so I have that all done and ready to go and now we're gonna check my beans oh you guys these are great oh so now I'm gonna finish cleaning my kitchen and get ready for company and I don't know if I showed you guys but I had to do 
a little like surgery on this. I had to use some CLR. Oh my gosh, this whole thing was coated. I don't know if I showed you the first time, but this whole thing was coated with white, you know, stain from hard water, like it was hard water deposits. Look at that CLR and just a little scrubbing, it took it all off. So now I got my sprayer back. I have like the regular like this, but now I've got my sprayer back. And it's, I got sprayed so well that it sprayed across the room. before dinner so it's just a block of cream cheese red pepper jelly oh it is so freaking good and just pour that over the cream cheese and I like pretzels but some people like like a a pita chips chips or crackers I like to do pretzels it's not so heavy and thick and you just take your pretzel and you just dip it in and then you get your jelly and your cream cheese together. This is so nummy. I love this. It's a great little appetizer to try before dinner or afternoon snack if you're going to watch a movie. I mean, I'm not going to eat until 7 o'clock, so this is perfect. I'm all done for the evening. I'm going to wash some clothes, get ready for the work week. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe so you know when all these great videos are up. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you hopefully can get a reminder when these videos are up. Have a safe and happy Easter. I hope everybody's well. Until the next time, you guys, bye-bye. Deep end, we're alive, living life underwater.